Last time on Star Trek The Next Generation. Catherine, my love. Dude, I'm not your wife. I can fool all you. That is it. I have had it with you, your crazy sons, this fracking island. Consider this game over. And now, the conclusion. I've watched enough horror movies to know if you don't see a body, then he ain't dead. Transport me down to the surface. Energize. See, I knew it! How the hell did you survive? You missed. Well, I won't be making that mistake again. Set the vaporize. Take care, my love. Oh, that slippery little bookworm. I'll get him next time. What's this that he left? A portal? According to my portal policy, you see one, you jump in. You never know what's on the other side. In this case, a trap. I should really change my portal policy. Hi, I'm Ben Kai. After successfully beating Real Mist last year, I decided to take a stab at Ribbon, which has been deemed even harder than Mist. Even my dad, who played it back in the day, said it was quite difficult, but he still beat it. And he even left a little cheat sheet showing the solution to one of the puzzles. I mean, that is a really detailed map. And on the back side, how to get every possible ending. That's some dedication. So I was going to do a video on the original Riven from 1997, but then I heard about the remake and asked the developers at Cyan about getting a review copy. And guess what? They said yes. I want to give a huge thanks to the folks at Cyan that provided me with this review copy. You guys are awesome. I apologize for the cage. Now let's get on with the game. Boo! Haha, <laughs> got ya. Sure. Hey, when did Tony Stark hey, cool. start dressing up as a colonial guard? Tony, Sit up. what are you doing? Hey, you better not be thinking about touching me. I'm warning you. <laughs> <laughs> Blocked you in my book. Careful with that book now. Those pictures may be too much for you to handle. Ooh la la! Ooh la la! Ooh la la! Tried to tell you. Graphically, this game looks amazing. All the locations look absolutely stunning, and these settings aren't even on high. No, I've got everything set to low except for the texture setting, and my resolution is set to 1080. Unfortunately for me, running the game on anything higher caused my RX 580 to dip into jerky frame rates. I imagine effects like the water could look even more amazing on a beefier computer, but as it is, you can play this on a six-year-old machine and have it still look nice. Hey, check it out, a lever. You know I gotta push it. Oh, that don't sound right. Uh-oh, uh, wait, we can't turn it off. Shoot. Oh, what did I do? Oh no, oh no, oops, yeah, we better not waste any of that steam, let's turn that off, just walk away, pretend nothing ever happened, wasn't me! Now the plot of the game is sort of simple, Atris calls you back to his little hidey hole for you to rescue his wife, thank god you've returned, I need your help, and to trap the kidnapper, Gen. The thing is, the book you need to trap Gen was taken by this mummy lady. So you gotta go recover the book, find Gen, trap him, and rescue Catherine. Eh, simple. Tony, you got some odd places for sleeping on the job. Navigation around the world of Riven feels like a Metroidvania type of game, without any of the shooting part and just the exploring. What I mean by that is Riven and all of its connecting islands require you to discover pathways to get to new areas. Every time you see a locked door, you can mark it with the new screenshot feature and even write notes on them. Exploring and figuring out how to get to the next area is a lot of the fun with this game. Knock knock, I got pizza. Hi, can you help me solve this puzzle? Hey, open back up, I still need help with this game. Further exploration can even yield shortcuts to past areas to reduce the time it takes to backtrack. Perhaps a favorite new area is the starry expanse that you get to from these spinning gold domes. First time I saw this, I was like, this wasn't in the original. This place acts like a nexus hub that connects all the different islands of Riven. 
you'll want to find each one to activate them to enable even faster travel between areas. Now here's a question for you. On this fish head thing from the original game, how do you think this is supposed to open? Perhaps from another location? Solve a puzzle? Find a power source? What if I told you that to open it up, you click this nondescript little area with no sign or clue it's even clickable? Now that's just total bogus. Bogus. Time and time again, hidden buttons and doors with no clues constantly show up in the original, but not in the remake. Everything here feels natural and makes sense. And with the ability to freely look around instead of the restrictive point and click frames, you can easily find paths that I totally missed in the original. Like this one on the jungle island. I clicked right past it without giving any thought. But in the FPS mode in the remake, I easily spotted it. That alone makes the remake superior. There are two major puzzles that have been reworked in the remake. To be more intuitive and logical. They are the stone animal puzzle and dragon ball puzzle. Or infinity stone puzzle depending on what show you're familiar with. Most of what you'll need to solve these puzzles will be at the Dunny School and Gen's lab. Rock delivery! Where do you want this rock? This looks like a good spot. Oh wow, there's all kinds of neat little things in this place. Let's start pushing buttons. That's always a good idea. Oh shoot. I broke it. Quick, get rid of the evidence. Sorry, I didn't mean it. That's gonna come off my delivery fee. You'll also find this eyepiece that will help you discover hidden writings all over the world of Riven. You'll need it to locate even more hidden passageways and secrets. Of course, if you want to know more about the lore of Riven and its people, you can always skim through the journals, which also lends clues to some of the puzzles. You got Atrus's that really has nothing much in it, so skip. Uh, Catherine's is more helpful, giving me some kind of code in an alien language. Gonna have to learn how to decipher that one. Then you've got Gen's journal, which provides lots of insights into the world, the puzzles, and family problems. Wait, family? Gen is Atrus's father? Father. Father? I am no longer your father because you are no longer my son. First his sons ended up being whack, now Pops is messed up too. Something is definitely wrong with his family. Especially Atrus. Catherine, my love. Can't catch a break with that guy. Eventually, you'll come by the Tay Age, a secret world built by the native Riven people to escape Gen and his tyrannical hold on the Age of Riven. What's up, bummy lady? Sup? They've got your book, so to get it back, all you do is ask. Nicely. Well, that was easy. Hey, Tony Stark didn't mess with any of the pages, did he? Oh, shoot. Uh, oops. Yeah, I deserve that one. Then you gotta go solve this materia puzzle, which involves going to an underwater survey station and angering a scary fish. Note to self, Riven Sharks hate Madonna music. It's off to deliver the book. What's up, dude? I am Gen. I assume you've heard of me. Actually, no. No one's told me any of the bad stuff you've done. Well, I'm sure he believes me to still be the depraved father I once was. I even tried to kill him once. Yeah, that'll get you put on the evil list. But hey, I'm pretty sure Atrus killed his sons. My sons have betrayed me. I know what I must do. And I tried to kill him, and he wants me to kill you, so I'd say that puts us all on an even morality field. Great father indeed, who tries to murder his own son. Don't feel so bad about yourself. No ages to link to, nothing but my own foolish ambition. Hey, this is kind of non sequitur, but you got your own set of materia? Which one you like the best? I personally love the yellow command materia ones, like the four times cut. Good stuff. Be sure the deeds of my past can never be... Oh, you're not even listening to me. I'm sorry, this is all a bit awkward. I... 
Uh, this will get your attention. I have your book. Thank you. About time. Now, I kind of need you to sign for that. So if you wouldn't mind, just you know, place your hand on the... Yep, yeah, that's it. Right there. You can do it. And I can be on my way. He's not doing it. Here. I shall follow you directly. What? I ain't going in there. Man, this place looks barren. I don't even see a bathroom, a kitchen, or even a PlayStation. You gotta have your essentials now. Come on. Did, did you just shoot me? I have changed. There was a time when I might have let you live. Yeah, how are we gonna play it? Oh, it's on now. Come on in again. It's nice and cozy in here. They even got a TV in here running Dragon Ball Z episodes. Sucker! <laughs> it was actually Dragon Ball GT. Enjoy watching subpar anime for life. <laughs> oh, Gen truly is a mad genius. Cooking dinner and getting free satellite TV. This dude is like the ultimate weeb. Got his grub and anime while Hein Wayne in his made up world basement. The work I am doing is quite demanding. Yeah, you do you, bud. I know what you're doing. Alright, this place is falling apart. Time to signal Actress. Benkai the Actress. Now will be a good time to show up. About time. We got a boogie on out of here. There isn't much time. Where's Catherine? Oh, crap. Wasn't that an optional side quest anyway? I mean, you can go find her. You, you still got some time. There's no time left. I lived up my end of the bargain. I got you again in a book, so get me out of here. This is where our paths must part. Hey, what are you doing? Goodbye, my love. Atris. Atris, you lying backstabber? Gotta go Keanu mode on this one. Geronimo! So that was a Riven remake. Fun game, much better than Myst, and heavily approves upon the original Riven. Some might think this remake is too easy, but that's why we still have the original to purchase on GOG, for all you masochists out there. And if you think that game's puzzles were too hard, Try being a developer for the game. No, it was a nightmare. It was just a nightmare. Because we, we kept thinking we had all the states done. Well, no, we're missing these 28 shots, or, you know, just endless amounts. Those guys are real winners of Riven here. It turned into, uh, hell. 